Hey, Robbie. Just kind of waiting for Dave. He had to go do something. Hi there. What you been up to today, Robbie? Hey, Rachel. I'm just waiting for Dave to get here. I'm excited. Aw. What crap, Robbie? Hey, Rachel. I'm excited. I don't know what Dave chose. Hey. I'm getting ready to do an unboxing. I'm just waiting uh, for somebody else to join. Yeah, I know I work today. I'm going to stay up until 4 o'clock in the morning and get up and go to work tomorrow. I'll be pleasant. Hey, Tavion. How you doing? Getting ready to do an unboxing. I'm just waiting for someone to get here. Um, it'll be just a couple of minutes. Got this. This to open up. So, just waiting for Dave. He'll be here in a couple minutes. Some of you know um, I was in the Squawking Dead um, Ultimate Fan uh, video competition. I'm doing good, Tyvion. Um, and I came in second to Rachel. Although, Rachel, you and I were neck and neck there. I know, right? It is a long box. Uh, Rachel, you and I were neck and neck there for a while. Um, so, Rachel was kind enough to, as uh, she came in second, and she was kind enough to gift one of her prizes to me, which was so very, very, very kind. I mean, it, that was just unbelievable. That was the nicest thing, Rachel. Thank you so much. Um, however, I could not choose what I wanted, so I got Dave from Squawking Dead to choose for me. So this is a complete mystery to me. I have no idea what is in here. Hey, Nissa. Hey, Michelle. How are you guys doing? I'm just waiting for Dave to get here. It'll be just a couple of minutes. Who all staying up to watch Fear tonight? Uh, thank you, Rachel. Yeah, it was so sweet. Anybody staying up to watch Fear? Three in the morning? Y'all know I wasn't going to miss it. Yeah, Michelle, I figured you would. <laughs> Can't miss it. Got to be there. I think they might be showing a world beyond after that, too. Come on, Robbie. Come on, I'll, I'll tweet with you. I know, I'm excited, and this is just a couple more hours. Oh, no, Rachel, not, uh, not work. I gotta work at, like, I gotta be there at 9, I don't know. I gotta be at work at 10 tomorrow, but I'm gonna do it anyway. Anybody know if they're doing a, a world beyond after? Yeah, I'm gonna try. Uh, I'm gonna try at midnight. Actually, I'm, I'm thinking maybe they'll do it then, because if I don't have to stay up until three in the morning, I don't really want to. But you know, I'm not gonna miss it. <laughs> yeah, I'll be sad too. I'll be very, very sad, and a couple other things. <laughs> Well, it did say it on that little picture you sent me. I mean, it did say Thursday at eight, uh, Thursday the eighth. So, I'm sure. Um, I just I hope it's. I hope they do it at midnight and not three in the morning. You think uh, TWD for life? You think it's the the uh, the world beyond afterwards? <laughs> I'm just uh, awake on excitement. I am so ready. I didn't. Th I, it felt like October 11th was never going to come. Who's got predictions for tonight? What do you think is going to happen? Yeah, we are very ready for it. Sorry, guys. Uh, Dave will be here in a minute. I know, Michelle. It is great. Yes, we know Morgan survived. We always knew Morgan was going to survive. <clears throat> I got my friend started on The Walking Dead today. He's never seen it, and we watched episode one today, and um, 
he really loved it. I got him. I got him hooked on it. He said it was nothing like he expected. He already hates Shane too, so that's a good start. Yeah, Sherry's coming back. Did everybody like the World Beyond? What did you think of it? Did everybody catch the um, Isabel reference? Just eh? Yeah, I agree with you, Robbie. People think it's all about zombies, and it really isn't about zombies. <clears throat> um, the theory is that when Elizabeth was talking about her daughter, about her daughter being in the CRM, that she was talking about Isabel. I, I mean, it has to be. Why else would they put that in there? Of course, that's of course it's going to be Isabel. And the map that she gave um, Hope and Iris was the same map that Isabel's partner had um, before she, uh, after she killed him. The one when Al opened up the maps, it was the same map. I mean, not the exact same map, but the same kind of map. Nope, <laughs> sure couldn't. Nope. The other theory is um, that she's looking for Isabel at the campus colony, and uh, <clears throat> that was why they wiped out the colony. Rachel, have you gotten any of your prizes yet? Guys, this was a great contest. I mean, the first, pr the grand prize, which Brian Castrillo won, was unbelievable. Uh, second place was awesome too. Um, even some of the voters got prizes. Um, they gave out um, Squawking Dead merch and um, a couple of prints too. A couple of Walking Dead prints. Um, the prizes were amazing. Yeah, that's that's cool. I was surprised this came so fast, to be honest with you. They've just messaged me. He's going to be here in just a minute. Right? Exactly. She would tell us all the time she was dangerous. They were dangerous. I thought that too, Robbie, that um, that was why she took out the colony because Iris was like, I don't trust you. And she, uh, uh, you know, kind of um, introduced uh, uncertainty into it. And since, hey, Dave is here. Yay! And since um, Iris kind of, you know, shut it down, she, she got uh, wor worried and took out the whole colony. Okay, guys, Dave is here, so we're ready. Yes, I was um, an entrant in the Squawking Dead Ultimate Fan Video Competition, along with several other awesome people. Um, Brian Castrillo won first prize. And Rachel, uh, the Walking Dead meme queen, and I were neck and neck through most of it for second place. And she got me in the end. But she was so kind, and she uh, um, gifted me one of her prizes, which was awesome. So, thank you so much. I'm going to let Dave in. Did I just make it tons worse <laughs> by joining? I can't hear this for some reason. Hey guys, I can't hear Sharon do for some reason though. I don't know if it's me. It's probably me. Oh, there we go. How about now? Perfect. Perfect. I'm like, Absolutely. oh, what did I do? I did ruin the stream. No, I had it on Bluetooth as a problem. So I think when you popped on, it knocked my off. Listen, that's that's the, the kind of effect I have. <laughs>
Uh, it's been a All long right. day. Huh? You, you have anything to say before I open it? I do. Um, so for the record, um, did you explain the story about how you couldn't choose? You just didn't yes. know what to choose? Okay, okay. I so There was no June and no Kim Wexler. What was I going to do? Exactly. But there, the, only, the only Kim Wexlers were customs, and they were over $30, and they got to follow the rules. Um, right. I looked for Junes. I looked for Dharmas. I looked for Jennas. I looked for – I even looked for Maggie Graces. I looked for Althea's. I looked for – let me see. It was one more thing I looked for, and I, I think I might have found, but it just wasn't good enough. And I settled on something that wasn't a Funko Pop. And my concern is, my concern is that you may already have it, but I'm wondering. I'm wondering. Because I don't have a whole lot of stuff, so it's, it's, I don't have a whole lot of merch. So I might luck out on this one then, I guess. Right, we're, playing the, right. we're playing the cards on this one. Yeah, All I'm right. ready. It's sealed. It's still sealed. All right. I'm, now I'm really excited. Hey, guys. <laughs> okay. Oh, God, I hope it doesn't fall out. <laughs> All right, here we go. Here we go. Ah! It's a Kim Wexler bobblehead! Oh my god, Jay! You don't have oh it, do you? Good. Oh, I think Are I just you... banged the mic. <laughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> oh my god! This is awesome. This... I nailed it. I nailed it. Can I tell oh. you what scared me? <laughs> I... I... I saw two tweets, because this is how studious I am. I, I do a little groundwork. I saw two tweets with you mentioning a Kim Wexler bobblehead. And I'm like, do I take, do I take the chance? You, I mean, you know I love Kim Wexler, so, you know. Yeah. It's like the number yeah. one. Honestly, it's, it's, I would even venture guess that you like Rhea Seahorn, Kim Wexler, more than you like... <laughs> No offense to Jenna Elfman or June Dory, but I think you like Kim Wexler a little bit more. She's a little yeah. bit more country, you know? Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Jenna's not, is she? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> yeah, no, not at all. <laughs> no. I'm I mean, sure she can play country. They're both badasses, just in yeah. different ways. Yes, exactly. Exactly. Okay, here comes. Have any of you guys, I know some of you have seen these online, but the detail in these is unbelievable. Oh, by the way, Robbie was saying uh, she had me enter a giveaway for her uh, for this bobblehead a while back. So that's probably what it was. That's probably what got me nervous. Because like, oh, shoot, she has it. Because somehow she got I'm Robbie not, to get her to win it. I'm not going to take the bobblehead thingy off, but yeah, that is so that cool. Was, Honestly, it, I, what got me worried is I. It looked. It looks better in person than than when it looked it, online. Man, look, and it's got her post-it notes in the back. Mm -hmm. It's got her. It's got her post-it notes. Like like these little details. Oh my gosh! And the tequila bottle. Zephyro yeah. Anejo. Anejo. Zephyro Anejo. And then and the ponytail. Oh. That's it. We got it. And the, Wexler McGill, Wexler McGill. It does not look like a stock market crash. Exactly, and yet. <laughs> oh my God, Dave, that. <laughs> that was, ah! <laughs> How could it be better other than fear on in four hours? <laughs> yeah, it, it's been a good day, but tomorrow gets even better, <laughs> technically. Oh, and yeah, you remember what you said in um, when we were talking about the blue paint in The Walking Dead season eight, and then the orange yeah. versus the blue. It's like they were, the writing was on the literal wall about how the series is going to end up. <laughs> Isn't it? Like them pitting themselves against each other? Yes. Huh? That's awesome. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> okay. Thank, thanks, <laughs> thanks uh, Rachel, by the way. <laughs> Rachel. I was, I was really nervous. Really nervous. Oh, that was, I mean, that... 
<laughs> Still nervous. No, oh, it's awesome. Dave, thank you so much. Thank you, Rachel. Thank yeah. you, guys. You're very sweet, Rachel. Good job. Yeah, it was very sweet. I'm like looking down at her like this. <laughs> I see you. I guess that's it, guys. So I'm going to go. Thank you, Dave. Thank you, everybody, for coming. And, uh, yeah, I'm going to be staying up tonight. I hope everybody else is. <laughs> uh, yeah, maybe. <laughs> Uh, all I can say is y'all might want to mute my feed for a little while. <laughs> oh, what are you going to turn into Robbie? <laughs> <laughs> boom, boom, Robbie. <laughs> Look, he, know, he, 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 he knows we know. He knows we know. That's why I did it. <laughs> uh, I, I mean, I'm not going to lie. I'm going to be tempted, but I'll probably keep my mouth shut. Yeah, you will. I know you will. At least for a while. Yeah. Some people, some people, we need to keep the hype going, you know, because if you, if you let the genie out of the bottle, it's going to be nothing left for everybody else. Yeah, I know. It's hard. Just, well, maybe I'll let you know if I watch it so that you can just harass the hell out of me. I'll, <laughs> I'll be like Jesus on the cross. <laughs> <laughs> he was a Jew. <laughs> All right. All right, everybody. Bye, guys. Take care, everybody. Have a good night. It's been a long Bye, day. See you later. Thank you. Bye. Bye.